What's up guys, today we have something really, really special that I'm adding onto the channel now. We have Master Wong. Master Wong, come over here. So, some of you, <laughs> some of you may recognize Master Wong. If you don't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I think he's got like two point, how two. many? 2.2 million yeah. subscribers. It's like going so fast right now. Um, all about combat, uh, Wing Chun, uh, self-defense, Tai Chi, all of this type of stuff. And uh, we've had the privilege uh, working together for, for a few years now. And while this interaction, I mean, we're, we're here in a beautiful Bali. We've been doing a lot of training That's right. every day. And the most beautiful thing is seeing this Tai Chi because I learned Tai Chi, um, I, know, I learned Kung Fu at a very young age. But oh, everything's all oh, beautiful movement, beautiful movement, everything looks good. But in fight, you don't know what to do, you know? <laughs> when, it, to do. when it gets to fight time, it's kind of like all over the place, you know? And what I love about what Master Wang is teaching is not just any Tai Chi, it's how to actually take Tai Chi, this physical movement and this physical uh, understanding of it, and apply it in your business, in your life, in your relationships, and everything you want. So, while we talk a lot about success and inspiration and, and how to take your life onto that next level, what I wanted to do on this channel, right, once a week I'm gonna add these videos in to give you some Tai Chi lessons. Number one, you can increase your health, be in better shape, right? You can be like this. A stronger. <laughs> get some nice <laughs> pair of titty. <laughs> and, then, and then get into nice shape. And as, aside from that, be able to take the learnings in an applicational way to take into your life as well and that's why today we want to start off with um, some Tai Chi basics yeah the some foundations basic. every week what we're gonna do we're gonna give you certain moves to practice so if you just want the Tai Chi part that's totally fine but at the same time if you want to use it in combat or yeah. self-defense it's very useful right because at least you know how to protect yourself in any environment but aside from that you can transfer it and use it in every area of your life and also um, get success in other areas too so Master Wong, maybe give let's, them, how do we start? Okay, like, yeah? so when you start the Tai Chi, very simple. Okay, fit together like this. Okay, very okay. simple, nicely, shoulder whip height. Shoulder okay. width. Yeah, okay. shoulder, so, shoulder so width. So you guys find yourself some space to practice. Yeah? Okay, so we're gonna do very basic every lesson, yeah. and add on, and then we talk about it, and then we add some application into it, so you can understand the, the idea, okay? Yeah. So basically, first you need to breathe in, and then breathe out. So nice and easy, and then what you do is just breathe in, and then your hand rise like this. Okay, up to here, and then nicely coming down. Okay, so that first basic movement with it. So like this again, nicely breathe in, and then breathe out. Now this is very common, yeah? When you see people doing this, they say, what they got to do with anything, this movement here, okay? So at first it's helping you to get used to your hand, yeah? And then you fit. They work together like this. See, hand and feet, they all work together in this movement here, like that. So when you see my hand, when I come down, it's like I'm forcing the pressure down, so nice and easy, and then you rise. Okay, if you want for the one more. I think a, 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 lot, a lot of people, they look at Tai Chi, they say it's really slow, it's for old people. That's what everybody in this retreat thought. And then when Master Wong was teaching it, he was showing you how everything is applicable. It's applicable, yes. So yeah. one, one, one more bit of this, so you can practice this first, okay? Yeah. So nice and easy, again, green. And then out. Okay, one more. Win. And then out. Okay. Now this is very important, okay? See how my hand coming in and back with like that. Okay? The movement. Say for example, if you grab my hand. See normally when people grab, they grab quite tight, see? Yep. So so your hand coming back like this, your hand come back boom like that. You see the you will come with the movement. So if I if I grab you, okay? And if you come up and then you move your hand right down, first, see you're forcing, you're, you're jerking down. That's where the problem is. You don't jerk, you can't grab me. You move. So if I, if I grab you, what? You see, you move him, you move. You, you guys think I'm acting this you're, out. You're moving. This is why I'm saying about when you know when we're doing, and then you've got big guy, yeah. and then it's easy to show. Yeah. But <laughs> because somebody grab over you, your arm come up like this. See my arm come up? Yeah. And then down, yeah. I'm forcing. Yeah, okay. so that's one, one movement of that. Okay. So now the thing as well is when the hand, like when you have the hand, you bring them down, see? Wow. You see okay. when you're, you're, this is why you have like this come up. Yeah. So why you grab in here, you yeah. grab somebody arm, you go. Yeah. Wow. And if I go very lightly, yeah, my mom is here. I add this into the combat, into understand. If I go very lightly, see my head here, where is what happened? Yeah. Uh, you ping you into my head, yeah. like, mm, like that, you flow into my head. 
So that's one basic movement of the hand. Yeah, so when you come up like this, you see your, your arm force, that's force down. And then you rise, see? Up. And then you force down. Another thing as well is like, if you put my hand on my shoulder, um, both hand, so your hand, see? Oh. You see the idea like this, see what? See, it's, it's you're tracking them down, isn't it? If I try it on you, see, look. Ooh, outside? Where do we go? <laughs> outside. Hey, outside. Outside. And then bring your hand into here, both hands right. up there, and pull it down. Pull down. Uh, so like come toward your waist. Okay. Like this. That's why I need time training. <laughs> in anything in life, you need to spend time a little bit, practice the basics. This, you put my hand on my shoulder. <laughs> see? If like, the hand here, see? Hand. Okay. <laughs> let me try, let me try. So I grab your shoulder, now pull in. Yes, but getting there. Getting there. But the problem <laughs> is, now. but the, the problem with this training is, you need to be body and mind and movement have to line together. And that takes practice. Yeah, take practice to so do. So that's that's why we give you one a week. All you do is just practice. Yeah, these practice things, yeah. this line and this movement okay. alone. So you go like this, brain. One, one one thing I got from you as well is because in the past when I've been to some Tai Chi lessons, everything was just like, oh yeah, just like oh yeah, water, water, water. But what I noticed about what you were saying before is that when we're practicing, we're still practicing that. Yes, because that otherwise power. it got no meaning for anything. That power. So yes. That, so that just it looks very slow, but through time we're actually building up a That's lot of strength. That's exactly that. So yeah. everything in life is the same. You practice the basic. It don't mean very much. But because you've been practiced with it, like this kind of movement here, okay, it look like this guy do flower arrangement. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> it's what just is, so beautiful. Yeah, it's so beautiful. But yeah. I can make it beautiful at the same time I can use it in combat. So when it attacks, show so, the speed. So on there, it's a punt come along for instance. So line here, see, uh. it's, it's so black. You, sometimes it's difficult because you're not that, um, that uh, understanding yet okay. because what is, uh, okay. it's yeah. very, yeah. if you see the whip, yeah. whip, whiplash, yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's like, it's like very dangerous, yeah, yeah. because yeah. some of them, you haven't practiced with it yet. Yeah. So this hand alone, see my hand, see yeah. the position? Yeah. yeah? Like so, so there's a reason behind yeah, so, so every if, movement. So if my hand is like this, it's a reason for my hand, yeah? So if yeah. you come close, see, yeah. I stop. So my hand is like hand here and hand, yep. you see? And then when I, yep. so I pull. Yep. Okay. Yeah? Got so it. this is why you move. And when you move, you don't move your hand like this, you see? You move with your body. Okay. You see, everything moves together with the body. And okay. your hand have to be in line. You see, Got like this. Okay? Let's, let's, let's do this then. Well, because otherwise it's going to get too complex. It's like a lot of people when they want to like, let's say play the piano, they just want to play the whole piece of music straight away. And you guys will be all hungry for all these different moves. but. As Master Wang always says, and as every master always says, it's very important to get the foundations right first. So we are going to do what some people call the boring shit, but we got to get the foundations right. And then if you practice over the weeks, then you can do the full arrangement. After That's that. right. Yeah? And then your hand in position. We do feel, and yeah. we explain feel, and then we talk about different things. Okay. So, so let's get, give them a few things to practice for this week. Okay. Just so, simple. Okay. Yeah? This for first, the, foundation. The, the first basic one, just practice the easy one first. Easy yeah. this one. Together. Shoulder whip high, yeah. okay? And just nice come up. Win. And, and don't, just, don't just go like this with a hand, yeah? Because if you do like this with a hand, you don't do anything. So you gotta go. Win. And nicely coming down. And when you put down, like you're forcing something down. And then you rise. Okay, so we do two of this. To get into the ideas, you can do many if you want. And then down. Now the important thing, you see my hand and feet right together as I do them, okay? Up, and then when you're down, you rise up together. This is important because when you're holding, you need to rise. It's like feeling the energy. Yes, like you're the, feeling them. It's so, like the chi, the chi. Yes, so if you, yes, if you put my hand there, see my hand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, so exactly the same way, see the hand, yeah. like that. Yeah. Another thing as well, for instance, if the fire that you, you will be thinking about like, yeah, but what, nobody's going to put your hand like this. Regardless, if you put the hand into my chest, yeah, the movement is exactly the same. Okay, the movement is exactly the same, regardless what is it, because they only flow in this direction, it's round. Okay, so when we practice this movement here, we just got to concentrate on, think, uh, do a lot of uh, breathing, so breathe, and then when you breathe out, and then you breathe in to get used to uh, breathe. When you're breathing, yeah, you've got to breathe from the tan tin, that is from your stomach. Breathe in, and then breathe out. Breathe in, and then breathe out, like that, okay? So when you do them, you breathe in, and then we come down, you push it down, you breathe out. 
very nice and easy okay you're thinking like that don't do anything so go nice and easy up and down very simple so if you have time do 20 count and very slowly and concentrate on that hand up and then when you get to here yeah and then push it down while you stand up in line and then what you want to do is when you're done that get somebody to put the hand on the shoulder and then your hand like this like like exactly the way you do it see your hand go like this see my hand go like this yeah so if you want to make it go oh let's try that in here it's be yeah it's, it's become very it's lethal lethal so you try that this way but towards yourself yeah that's it see yeah, yeah? so okay and you put your head out as well so, yeah so, so if you got pop pop my hand pop, yeah. pull, pull down again yeah. see and put your head in see yeah. what happened is you see yeah pulling them inwards yeah and then so, and then also down yeah to, to, to keep them so yeah so if i if you put my hand to my shoulder yeah. so my hand see yeah, yeah when i down here yeah. yeah and now it's easier to control the arm now yeah yeah when you control the arm you're changing side yeah to break in yeah now this is funny people thinking like it's not gonna is it hurt uh you've got a hold of me <laughs> okay so two things you're understanding when you get hold of this wrist this is ready see you lock this joint yeah and you see yeah. ready to snap now yeah. you see ready slap yeah. now for instance you said what about can he tense tense your arm so now he tense problem yeah what so now <laughs> that's that's the beaut that's the beautiful thing though because that, that's what you're teaching there, right? That's right. If Because in life, we hit different things, right? Some things come in softer, that's some things right. come in... Something soft yeah. and something hard. And every yeah. time we create something, you tense it like... Yeah. like if, if you're in life and you try to get somebody to, to do something, they're all tense like this. Yeah. You, you will be stuck. So you yeah. sit there, sit like this. You and then relax. Change your strategy. Yeah? Yeah? So when you relax, you pull, you yeah. upset, you see? Lock. Yeah. And then now it's easy for you to move them. Yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah. But each of this movement will take time for you to work. Okay, so that's a basic uh, working. So put your hand in the shoulder yeah. and hand like this. Yeah. See my hand pinging into me? Yeah. Okay? Yeah. So drive it. Yeah. Yeah? That's the basic. Yeah. Okay? So when, you, when you get that movement right, yeah. and then we add on each one. So just this for now. Just, just yeah, for because it's so much to think about. You got finger hand. Yeah. See, it's like you're painting. Yeah. So when you, if you start to thinking like you're gonna move like this, or you start to go in and then you start doing all these things. Yes, but you can't not move your arm yet. You can't do any of this kind of movement. Yeah. Boom, bang, and you got attack. Then because you come back, you're like, um, it's 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 needful. <laughs> yeah. If you're gonna able to use it, it's very needful. But if you don't know how to use it, you just go like this. And you don't know what you're it's doing. Good. A lot of it, a lot of it, what we've been learning is a lot of it is down to your positioning, right? The way you position yourself and just like in life, the way you, you are positioning yourself to protect yourself or when you are in that more attacking stage, where, where to position yourself, where people's weaknesses, when things come your way, how you can deflect it, it instead of fighting it, right? Instead of pushing against it, how you can use, let's say the anger comes in, you can allow it just to deflect and go away and not to fight against it otherwise it'll just be clashing that way you know so everything's about this type of leverage so this is the basics and the fundamentals just one thing breathing practice strength practice that's it and find somebody or maybe a partner practice get that part right just on breathing every single day just practice it and then next week what we're going to do we're going to have another video giving you the next steps like i said one thing at one time Anyway, guys, if this video has been of use for you, or if it's, just, if it's just been of entertainment having Master Wong here, please do hit that thumbs up, hit the like button. Also, comment below. Let us know your questions. If you have any questions around this, let us know, and let us know where you guys have tuned in from, because we're actually going to be doing some US tours, and we're going to be doing a lot of tours around the world as well, so we may see you around. And finally, if you're new to the channel, remember, remember to hit that subscribe button and the notifications button next to it, because this year, I'm dedicated to making a whole bunch of videos to hold you accountable to make it your best year yet but for now guys i think what we do is out right how do you out <laughs> out